going to turn now to an update on a tense situation we'll be covering all evening in Lakeview. A police standoff that came to a peaceful end, thankfully. It started after a man shot two dogs who were out for a walk with their owner. One of the dogs has died. But we are hearing tonight that the man who shot them will not be charged. NBC5's Evrod Kasmi joining us live from Lakeview tonight. Evrod, I think the big question a lot of us are asking, why won't he be charged? Well, here's the thing, Stefan and Allison. Police tell me that the owner's two large dogs, as they're described, made this man fear for his life, so he shot them. He is licensed to carry, so tonight he's not facing any criminal charges, and he is at home. And here's what happened all earlier today. It's extremely upsetting and it's kind of scary to be out with my dog right now. Pretty tense moments for neighbors in Lakeview Tuesday afternoon. Streets blocked off and a huge police presence, including the SWAT team, after a man shot two dogs and ran off into a building. I just heard people running around and just dispersing from the scene and I just wanted to get away just because I didn't know if there was an active shooter hostage situation. Mahila Breachy was doing a delivery in the area when she pulled up to the chaotic scene. I was definitely scared because I didn't know what was going on. Police tell us a woman was walking her two dogs off leash when they came close to a man. He went down an alley and they followed him. That's when he shot both the dogs. I've seen people walk dogs off leash and some dogs are very well behaved. I keep my dog leashed when I walk my dog um, and then if my dog is um, reacting, I tend to walk towards the streets to keep her away from other people. And here's the thing, the whole situation came to an end around 6.30 tonight. And while one dog is dead, the other dog is in the hospital from those gunshot wounds. So as for the owner of those animals, well, she could face charges for having her dogs off the leash. Reporting live in Lakeview tonight, Everett Casimir, NBC5 News.